<laughs> Jepa. Uh, lah lama tak baca kan. Yeah. Allahumma ftah alayna hikmataka wa syur alayna min ghazaini rahmatika ya arhamar rahimin amin Rabbi syrah li sadari yasirli amri wahlul udatan min lisani yafqahu qawli amin Rabbana atina fi dunya hasana wa fi akhirati hasana wa kina azabana amin Amin Alright So now, okay, I'm sharing my screen, alright. So can you see my screen now? Yes. Okay, kau nampak kan screen teacher kan? Nampak. Okay, very good. Nampak. Okay, so now let's go to quizzes. Okay, alright, so we start now. Okay, so kalau ada yang join me, Syaki, kalau kamu perasan, hampak teacher lah. Right? Bila, bila buka quizzes tu, tak nampak dah. Okay. Alright, uh, so this is our topic for today. Okay, uh, still in the same topic. Alright, extreme situations. Alright, uh, this is under lesson 67, 68. Okay, our focus for today is speaking. Alright, close up textbook, page 89. Alright, so do you have close up textbook with you now? Ada tak buku teks? Yes. Yeah. Okay, very good. So, you may refer to page 89. Alright. And we will use English book 2. Okay. So, let's go to the next slide. Okay. So, I want you to copy the success criteria in your English book 2. Okay. Alright. Boleh sadar tak ini? Alright. Uh, the success criteria by the end of the lesson. Alright. Yeah, you will be able to. Alright. Share your experience about your, okay, share your experience on extreme sport. Okay, your experience, your opinions on extreme sport. All right, take the statements that describe extreme sports and explain six extreme sports listed by using the useful expressions given and describe two, two photographs of extreme sports. All right, so... Throughout this lesson, alright, you will do all these activities, okay? So, I want you to copy this in your English book too. Can you do that? Yes. Okay, hasilin yes. cepat. Okay, hasilin dulu. Kalau rasa malas, teacher malasnya nak salin. Boleh tak? Saya nak screenshot je, nanti saya nak print. Ah, ikutlah. Okay, it's up to you. Alright, ha, kalau nak jimat ink tu salin lah sikit je ni. Okay, siap? Siap ada lagi? Kita tengah cari pensil. Baru nak ambil pensil. Hmm, dah agak dah. Okay, check your time. Okay, dah siap habak nak? Okay, dan Macam dah? Siapa tak? Tak ada siapa.
Okey dah kot noh. Dah kah? Dah satu gi satu satu gi. Okey okey okey. Senyap je semua. Serius sangat apa ni? <laughs> oh fokus okey lah fokus lah. <laughs> Siap teacher. Okay so the rest siap juga nah. Okay so let's go to the next slide. Okay so the, for the next slide you will watch, you are going to watch a video. Okay about extreme sports. Alright but these are done by professionals. Okay please do not follow them. Alright unless you are trained to. Okay. Lagi ada yang ikut saya lagi. Nanya teacher. <laughs> Okay. 
juga. I make notes and every my class. Yeah. My hands are too lazy, I just use my feet to wash. Okay, let's go to the next slide. Okay, so we have watched, okay, people doing extreme sports. Okay, so let's go to the next slide. Okay, so I'm going to ask you, have you ever done an extreme sport? If not, would you like to? Okay, so kita nak panggil siapa ni? Spin the wheel. Okay. All right. Is Urin you there? Yes. Okay. So, what's your response? Have you ever done an ice cream sport? No. Okay. Would you like to? Yes. Ah, uh, yes. Okay. Why not, right? Okay. Let's call. Siapa ni? Tint, 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 tint. And 
All right. Is that the? Is that you there? Is that it? Is it hilang? <laughs> okay, tapo kita speed again. Okay, speed again. Ada pikir siapa ni? Okay. Alright, Theo, you there? Yes. Okay, so what's your response? I never done it, but I would like to. Okay, you have never done that. Okay, all right. This is a script. Okay. <clears throat> okay, so let's go to the next slide. All right. So have you ever been to any extreme places? Ah, okay. So you, if you have, let's tell. If you don't, okay, it's okay. Let's tell too. Okay, kita tengok dia panggil siapa. Alright, Aisyah Bal is Aisyah Balkis, is it? Ah, Aisyah Bal ni siapa? <laughs> oh, Aisyah Balkis. Ah, Aisyah Balkis kan? Okay. Ha, Aisyah, so... How about you? Um, yes, I have been to extreme places in Indonesia, Bali. Wow, okay. Can you tell us more about your experience? What do you do at the place? Um, right and ATV. Okay, right and ATV. Right, very good. So, do you like the experience? Uh, yes. <laughs> yes. Okay. Okay. So let's spin again. Okay, very good, Aisha. Dia panggil siapa ni? Ah, husband ni. Husband ni? How about you? Yeah. How about you? Ah, have you ever been to any extreme places? No. <laughs> no. Okay, maybe one day, right? Ah, when the COVID-19 is over. Why not, right? Okay. Yes. Okay. Ah, so, let's go to the next one. All right, so you need to tick the statements that describe extreme sports. All right, you can tick more than one, okay? Okay, time's up. Siapa yang tak sempat ni? Dah kau. Okay. So, let's see. Ah, uh, Siapa yang jawab dia are relaxing ni? <laughs> okay. Alright, extreme sports. Okay, actually, um, okay, I think it's in your opinion is they are relaxing. Uh, maybe not. Okay. Uh, you can, alright. Uh, you can see, okay, they are dangerous. In the end, you get a sense of achievement. All right, they are very exciting. Yes, you need a good instructor. Yes, all right. Uh, they are relaxing. Uh, it's not appropriate, actually. Okay? All right. Go to the next slide. Okay, so uh, this is in the exam close-up. All right, in page 89. Okay, so they give you one skill. All right, during speaking. Okay, for speaking, usually during speaking test, actually. All right, the skill of paraphrasing. Okay, paraphrase. All right, meaning, uh, let's say if you don't know or you can't remember a word in the exam, all right, try not to waste time trying to remember it. All right, so what can you do is you think of another way of saying the same thing. All right, this is called paraphrasing. All right, uh, this is the technique of paraphrasing during speaking. Okay, so let's say 
next year you have speaking test okay so until form 5 until muet okay you will have uh, speaking test all right uh, so this is the one skill that you need to cover all right paraphrasing okay uh, so paraphrasing ni all right it's more like uh, if you forgot something if you forget something all right you want to say the word you forgot the word all right you forget the word and you want to uh, think of another word all right that has the same meaning all right uh, you don't change the meaning okay for example let's see okay this is the original text Wuli Wonka was famous for his delicious candy. Children and adults love to eat it. Alright, uh, so let's say this is what in your mind you want to say. But uh, you forgot. Alright, so what can you say? Uh, Wuli Wonka was known throughout the world. Known throughout the world means famous. Alright, because people enjoy eating the tasty candy he made. Okay, you see uh, the whole sentence here has the same meaning like the original text, that paraphrasing, okay? Uh, so, this is the skill that you need to cover, okay? Uh, so, let's go to the next slide. Okay, so this is the useful expressions that you are going to use after uh, for the next activity, okay? All right, so the expressions, all right, for paraphrasing, all right, you need to, okay, you can use uh, this kind of expressions, okay, for example, is a sort of, okay, is kind of, is a, or an activity that uh, is a place where uh, is a person who dot dot dot, I think is a dot dot dot, alright. Uh, next, you shouldn't do it on your own because dot 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 dot, alright, you have to be careful of it, it could, it could be, might be a dot dot dot, dot alright. It's similar to, it's dangerous because you need the edge to do it. Okay, some equipment such as is necessary to, all right. So these are useful expressions that you can use, all right, during speaking, all right. Okay, so you can refer this in page 89, okay. Dalam buku text, all right, your close up textbook, page 89, all right. So you can refer to these useful expressions, okay. All right, and don't forget to copy this in your book later. All right, so now we are going to go to the next slide. Okay, so for the next activity, you read the exam close up, and then explain the following pictures by use, using the useful expressions. Okay, so let's see the next picture. Okay. So, this is a picture we have. Okay, the picture of bungee jumping. Okay. Taksi lah pula. Tak apa. Okay. So, what do you think of bungee jumping? So, what can you do is, you take the useful expressions given in your textbook. Okay. Uh, you can use more than one, more than one useful expressions. Alright. Uh, so, I want you to write in your screen. Alright. Uh, so, what do you think of bungee jumping? Uh, you can see it's sort of what or uh, you can use uh, it's dangerous because of what okay uh, so make use of the useful expressions given so can you do that boleh buat kan yes okay cuba buat dulu okay very good Zahawa from my point of view bungee jumping is a very extreme sport because it takes a lot of risk but at the same time it's very exciting sports okay very good Alright, it's clear and simple in uh, sentence. Okay, the rest you may try, okay?
Okay, we got response from Dia. It's dangerous because it involves a person jumping from a great height while connected to a large elastic rope. Okay, very good. Okay, Aisha Ball. <laughs> it's very exciting. Can face guy yet? <laughs> okay, what's guy yet in English? <laughs> okay. Okay, Alia. Extreme sport writing is the best sport that I want to try. Okay, very good. Okay, Tio, simple. Alright, it's kind of dangerous. Okay, is that T? Dangerous and exciting. Izurin, you shouldn't do it on your own because it takes a lot of risk and you need someone professional to lead. Yes, very good. Okay, Dayang, I think it's a fun sport because you can fly. Okay, good one. Okay, next, uh, we have from Hazwani. Okay, you need to be brave to do it. Yes, it's not for the faint-hearted. Okay, ha, yang kata gayat tu kan. Ha, gayat tu is more like afraid of heights, alright? Alright, I think maybe they have scientific uh, words for that. Okay, maybe you can find for me. Okay, very good. Okay, let's go to the next one. Okay, how about scuba diving? Okay. Why do you think of it? Remember to use the useful expressions. Okay, write your responses first. And next, uh, after you have done, I will call randomly, okay? To tell us about your answer. We can see fish texture. <laughs> All right, remember to use the useful expressions, okay? Aziz, Aziz, are you okay? Okay. Okay, let's see. All right, uh, so we want to call, siapa ni? To read your response. All right, to talk about your response, okay? This is, is speaking, right? Okay, is it in? You there? Yes. Ah, okay. So how about your response? Mana is during your response? Okay. Can you tell us about your opinion on scuba diving? Pasien tu je, teacher. Yeah. 
I think it's a good activity for those who like swimming because this activity can make us explore the seas to see many kinds of fish. Okay, very good. Okay, let's see. Kenapa dia suka sangat Izuri ni? Okay, dah go. <laughs> okay, Dayang. Dayang, you there? Dayang, Dayang ada tak? Yeah. Okay. Alright. So, wait, okay. Ha, so, uh, why do you say that we can drown? Because um, uh, if you don't have an instructor. Uh, <laughs> okay, right. If you don't have in, an instructor, right? Yes, why not? Can ha? Must we must have an instructor. Ah, uh, kalau sila segi hmm kyo. Okay. Let's see. Ya Allah kucing ni. Okay, ha Zahawa. Okay, Zahawa. How are you there? How are you there? Click, 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 click. Okay, it's all right. Okay, from Zahawa, for my opinion, this sport is so good to be experienced because we can explore the sea and it is very entertaining. Okay, very good. Okay, so most of you, your responses are good. Okay, all right. I think it's interesting activity, many types of fish. Yes, why not, right? Okay. All right, let's go to the next slide. Come on, go. All right, uh, what do you think of scurfing? When you look at this picture, what do you think of it? Okay, it's very dangerous but exciting. We can be pulled by the waves. Okay, Aisha Ball getting better. Alright, ha, daripada awal-awal tadi dia boleh pepek-pepek sikit. <laughs> okay, let's wait from the others, okay? Okay, Dayang. It could be exciting, yes, because you can enjoy the view. Seem dangerous for those who do not know how to swim. Yeah, imagine if you fall down, right? Okay. Alright, I think scuffing is an extreme sport because we usually play in the middle of the sea. Only people love challenging sports would be would love to play this. Yes. Okay, for Azwani, you have to be careful of the big waves. Yes, because it's quite dangerous and you will get injured. Okay, dia some equipment such as special. Dia tadi hilang tak? Okay, a special rope connected to a boat is necessary to try this sport, all right? All right, it's curving. You have to be put behind the boat, the rope. Exciting and extreme at the same time, yes. Yeah. Okay, remember to use the useful expressions, okay?
Okay, time's up. All right. I want to call. Siapa ni yang tak sempat ni? Tak nampak. Uh, let's see. Eh, dah yang dia call lah tadi, no? Okay, Dia, you there? All right, Dia? Yes, teacher. Dia. Ah, okay. So, what do you think of scurfing? Some equipment such as a special rope connected to a boat is necessary to try this sport. Okay, so, okay, you think, all right, we need some equipment, okay? All right, how about Theo? Theo, you there? Jawapan Theo tak ada kat sini. Okay, Theo? Tak sempat. Okay, so Tio, what do you think of scuffing? Uh, you shouldn't do it on your own because if you fall down. Okay, alright, good. Okay, kenapa Tio bunyi je macam terlalu jauh daripada komputer tu? <laughs> okay, it's alright. Alright, let's go to the next one. Okay, just now we have scuffing. Now we have windsurfing. Alright. Ha, nampak macam sama macam scuffing. It looks the same. Uh, but this is windsurfing. Windsurfing is look like a sail. Okay. Uh, what do you think of windsurfing? Okay, take your time. And please use the useful expressions, yeah? Ah, Dah yang ter... Tak sempat tu. Alright, you need to be careful to do it because you what? Dash, 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 dash. Okay, Zurin is similar to scuffing but this activity is more extreme. Eh, mana hilang dah? <laughs> okay, and doesn't need a boat to put it. Okay, yes. Okay, Aisha Ball. Okay, Aisha getting better. Okay, dangerous but very challenging. Okay, self-balance is very important. I want to try this to represent Malaysia. All right, very good, Rasha. Okay, from Hazwani is similar to surfing, but this one looks more fun and interesting. Okay, Zaharwa, from my point of view, we surf is very risky sports, okay? Because we have to be wise in handling it, but it's very an exciting sports to people who love water sports, yes. Yeah, activity they combine surfing and sailing. <laughs> yes. Okay, I think it's an, an interesting activity because it is extreme and you can enjoy it. Okay, good. Oh, yeah, you need to know how to control the wind. Yes. All right. Okay. So, siapa yang tak sempat? Okay, Dania, you there? Yes, teacher. Okay, so Dania, what do you think of windsurfing? Any idea? I think the activity is similar to Scuffing, but it is more 
extreme and fun. Okay, yes. very good. Okay, ah, that's one good, good response. Okay, all right. Okay, next one. All right. <clears throat> ah, this is called free diving. All right. If you see, they have no oxygen tank at, uh, attached at their back. All right. Uh, so would you try free diving? Would you? All right. If you want, uh, what's your reason? If yes, what's your reason? It's around just free diving. Of course, I would. Okay. Okay, so if you say you would, what's your reason? Okay. Yes, it is fun to explore under the sea. Right. No, because it looks dangerous. No, I wouldn't because I don't like water and darkness. Yes, we don't know what's underneath, right? Yeah, definitely not because I'm afraid of the deep sea and it looks very dangerous. No, because you need to learn to breathe holding to learn how to hold your breath, your breath. Okay. From there for so long. Yes. Yeah. It's very dangerous, but looks interesting. I don't want to try. <laughs> I'm too young to die. <laughs> Aisha. <laughs> Okay, is that the now because I don't like diving? Okay, yes, why not? You can have new experience for those who never try it. At the same time, you can explore more marine life, all right? Maritime, marine. Okay, now it's because I don't know how to swim. I'm scared of darkness. Yeah, the lagita. Yeah, semua dah kot. Sebab Hazwa ni ada dua nama. Right now. Okay, uh, so seorang je. Aina, Aina, you there? Aina. Aina Arisha. Ke tak ada line? Okay, tak apa. But okay, your responses are very good. Alright, so getting better. Okay, so most of you, okay. Not most of you, all of you, okay, you, you are you are using that useful expressions, all right? Huh? So you can see, right, when you use the useful expressions given, all right, so you can give your ideas more appropriately, you see? All right, so let's try the other one, the next one. Okay, huh. just now we have free diving, now we have... Pedal boarding. Uh, pedal boarding is okay. It looks, looks easy, but do you think it's easy? Alright. Uh, nampak macam relax je kan? Alright. But do you think it is? Okay. Try to write your opinion. Okay. What is your opinion about pedal boarding?
Kalau tak ada siapa respon ni, lalu laju je. Alright, you have one minute, 24 seconds. I think it looks easy, but it was hard to stabilize your body without getting fall. Yes. Imagine if you fall down. Okay, for Hazwani, it looks easy, but not too risky. Okay. Um, it looks easy, but it's quite risky, right? Uh, you need an instructor if you are first timer. Okay. Yes. I am very good. You need to be balanced. All right. Yeah. So pedal boarding is all about balancing. Okay, it's an activity you can relax and enjoy the view. Okay, balance is very important in this sport. This the sport challenge my patients I have tried. Okay, all right. <laughs> I think I'm too heavy. It can make us depressed. <laughs> okay, Aisha, later you you have to talk about this. <laughs> okay. I think pedal body is an extreme sport because it obviously we play with wave and it's risky. All right. It's very exciting. Yes. I think it's very fun activity to do with family and friends, but you need to have a very good self balance. Okay. You're getting better. Okay. So I can see the flow of your ideas. All right. Ah, nampak dah ideas too. All right. Very good. Okay. So now, okay. Let's hear from Aisha. Aisha, you there? Aisha? Oh, Aisha. Aisha boy? Yeah, teacher. Uh, okay. Uh, because I, I want you to tell us about your experience. Uh, okay, about this pedal boarding. Uh, since you have tried. Can you tell us more about it? Uh, yes. Okay. Tell us. Tapi susah nak explain nama saya bahasa Inggeris, teacher. Okay, so, it's okay, it's okay. Alright, try, just try, okay? So, when did you try this sport? Um, kat, kat tu, nama apa tu? Kat sungai dekat Thailand tu. Ayah, um, kat Thailand tu kat mana? Kat Manang, apa tu? Manang, saya rasa nama tu kat situ tempat dia. Oh, okay. So, how, how do you, how do you do it? Um, dia bagi macam kayu tu. Lepas tu dia suruh macam tu. Mula-mula dia kata nak tak tahu lah dia cakap dengan ayah saya lah. Saya tak tahu bahasa start Thailand dia cakap English lah dengan ayah saya. Aha. Uh -huh. so, saya kata lah saya ni dah cukup umur saya nak buat sendiri. Okay. Bila dah buat dia cakap macam tak tahu lah dia kena ada keseimbangan macam dia kena kaki dia kena betul. Lepas tu saya buat sendiri dia cakap macam benda tu tenggelam. Saya rasa macam saya ni berat sangat. Kau sampai tenggelam macam ni. <laughs> saya, saya stress saya tak nak main lah. <laughs> yes, because you need to have balance, right? Ha, yeah. Nampak macam relax, right? Uh, because you, if you are too heavy, do you think you are, are you too heavy? I don't think so. <laughs> okay. <laughs> so it can make us depressed. Okay, so maybe the rest you can try, right? Okay, very good Aisha. Thank you for your response. Alright. Ha, Aisha ni menarik. Dia banyak experience. <laughs> okay, how about the others? Ada tak yang lain? Have you ever tried pedal boarding before? Kot lah, hmm. you went to Langkawi ke, kan? Ha, because I saw this, I uh, mean this uh, pedal boarding. Okay, some people are doing this in Langkawi, right? Okay, maybe after COVID-19 is over, you can go there and try, okay? Alright, so let's go to the next slide. Okay, so now we are doing the exam task, alright? Okay, you will have two paragraphs, alright? You have to describe the paragraph. And you must use the useful expressions given, okay? Uh, so, you can use more than one useful expressions. Jangan guna satu je. Use more, alright? And write, I think you can write around at least three sentences. Okay? So, let's look at this picture. Okay. You can see this is rock climbing. Okay? Alright, so when you look at the picture, so write in uh, around at least three sentences, at least. But if you want to write more, it's up to you. Okay? Alright, so describe this picture. Uh, so what can you see? Look around this picture. You can see the main face. 
Alright, uh, what do you think he is having now? What do you think he is feeling now? Okay, uh, look at his equipments. Alright, uh, look at the environment, the, the scenarios. Okay, look around him. Alright, uh, talk about it. Oh, wow. Okay, let's see your response. Okay, baru dapat satu je dan Mia. <laughs> okay, yang lain ni kenapa? <laughs> okay, it's okay. I can call one by one. Okay, so from Daniel, it's very dangerous because you really have to be depending on the rope. Besides that, you need to have a lot of energy while doing this extreme activity. Alright, it could be more fun if you are already good at it. Okay, very good Daniel. Okay, so yang tak sempat tu, kita nak panggil siapa eh? <laughs> okay, kita nak panggil siapa? Ah, dia. Ada dia je dia? Dia ada tak? Klik, 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 klik. Okay, tak apa. Kita panggil pakai wheel lah. Tengok lebih kat mana. Okay. Ah, uh, Hazwani? Yes, teacher. Okay, so how do you describe that picture? Mm, it is uh, an activity that I have tried it before. Mm -hmm. mm, some equipment such as the helmet, rope, glove and safety belt is necessary to do it. Mm -hmm. It could be very fun and, fun and interesting if you never try it. Okay, very good, Hazwani. Okay, huh, very good. All right, uh, so you have experienced that before, right? Okay, so let's spin again. But ini ramai tak sempat kan? Tak apa, we just talk about it, right? Because this is speaking. All right, so we speak. Okay, Dia. Dia, you there? Okay, maybe Dia is, okay, maybe the line is not okay. It's okay, try Spin again, no problem. And dia nak pergi siapa ni? Okay, Izzati you there? Izzati? Izzati pun hilang. <laughs> okay, tak apa. Alright. Last one, last one, last one. Alright, Izurin, you there? Yes. Okay, so Izurin, alright, uh, how do you describe that picture? 
it's kind of dangerous. He looks so happy with it, but it takes a risk and he may fall if he doesn't follow the right step. His body was surrounded by a rope to make sure his safety is good. Okay, very good. Alright, so don't forget to write your responses in your English book too, okay? Alright, okay. uh, so the rest, I think, okay, you can write more than that. Alright, refer back to the useful expressions. Okay, good. Okay, now, you want to go to the next picture. Okay. Alright, uh, this is the Arctic photographer. Alright, maybe you say, okay, teacher, what is photographer going to do with sports? Okay, because you see, this is the extreme situations here. Okay, uh, so if you don't have the skill, I don't think any photographer can do this. All right, you have to take pictures. All right, uh, at this, I mean, at the Arctic. Okay, so, so what can you do now is, I want you to describe this picture. Look at the photographer, look at the equipments. Look at the surroundings, all right? So if you look around the surroundings at the Arctic, what do, what do we have at the Arctic? Okay, you can talk about it, okay? Okay, can you try now? Okay. Coba dulu. Tak dan tulis pun teacher. Tak dan tulis. <laughs> Tapi ada je tu. <clears throat> okay, so it's difficult. Okay, from the hawa, okay. For this object photographer to capture any photos due to the weather and it need to be focused. <clears throat> okay. From Alia, you need skills if you want to do it. Yes. Fun activity, you get to take beautiful pictures. Yes, you need skills and proper equipment, right? Okay, it looks easy, but at the same time, it looks fun. I think I can do it. <laughs> so, Malaysia, please send me that. <laughs> I shall born no tea. <laughs> okay, my Zurin, he has a lot of experience taking pictures at the extreme place because if someone who doesn't have an experience or didn't learn, it may take the risk, right? So, it's risky if you don't have the experience. Alright, so imagine is if a, a polar bear, alright, come and attack you. Okay? Okay. So, okay. So, I want you to look at the next picture. <laughs> so, what do you think of this? <laughs> what happened to the Arctic photographer? <laughs> Kena makan kot teacher. <laughs> Kena makan. Okay, so the the polar bear, alright, has eaten the photographer and taken over all, all the equipments. <laughs> Come, tell us about, oh, okay, tell us about your opinion about this picture, okay? What do you think?
<laughs> the polar bear wants to work like people. <laughs> The a pig bear is shaking the object in front of it. <laughs> the photographer is scared and hides somewhere else and I think the polar bear wants to be a photographer too. <laughs> oh, the polar bear looks so cute. He might love to take pictures. Polar bear is cute, yes. <laughs> I think the polar bear was attacked. Okay, the polar bear attacked the photographer. Alright, if you say the polar bear was attacked by the photographer, it means a different thing. Alright, because of the was. Alright, so the correct one to be, I think the polar bear attacked the photographer. Okay, without the was here. I think the photographer was eaten by the bear for being busy buddy. <laughs> this spot is tough. Don't send me. I'm too young to die. <laughs> okay, Hazwani. You have to be careful with the bear. It's dangerous because you will probably be eaten by the hungry bear. <laughs> okay, it might be very dangerous if you can save yourself. Yes. <laughs> All right. Okay. Okay. Uh, this is the last slide. Okay, do you know anyone that does an extreme sport? All right. Are uh, extreme sports appropriate for all ages? Uh, so you look at this. All right, so these are uh, kind of uh, a bunch of teenagers. All right, they are training for parkour, I guess. All right. Uh, so do you know anyone? All right. Maybe your favorite artist, all right? Your favorite singer, your favorite K-pop, okay? K-pop artist, all right? Ah, so that does that extreme sport. Ah, all the extreme sport that you have uh, watched just now, you have seen just now. So do you know anyone involved in that kind of sport? All right? So are uh, extreme sports appropriate for all ages, right? Okay, I want you to tell us about your uh, about your opinion. Okay, yes, I know in my opinion, extreme sports is not as uh, appropriate for all ages because very dangerous and risky, yes. You can have accidents, all right, if you're under age, she was given to play, right? So if you know anyone, okay, tell us about their name. Okay, why not, right? Okay. Jadi dah awal seorang je. Okay. Kita panggil Hatland. Tengok. Okay. Lain mungkin tak sempat. 
All right, Dayang, you there? Uh, yes, teacher. Okay, Dayang. Okay, ha. Huh. So, do you know anyone that does an extreme sport? Yes, I know. Okay, who is that? Uh, extreme sport? She actually <laughs> He died. Oh, then Okay, so do you think uh, extreme sports appropriate for all ages? No, because kids are not tough enough to do this. Okay, because kids are not fit enough, right? Okay, good one. Okay, good one, Dayang. Okay, let's see the next one. Di nak panggil siapa ni? Okay, Izati ada tak? Izati? Ke lain tak ada? Okay, it's okay. We spin again. Okay, Zahawa. How about you? Ah, this is your response. Do you know anyone, Zawa? Zawa dah ada dalam Google Meet ke? Oh, dia tak ada, dia tak ada kat Google Meet ke? Cik. <laughs> Patutlah, kenapa tak masuk Google Meet? Okay lah, tak apalah. Okay, kita spin lagi. Okay. Uh, Okay. All right, Hazwani? Yes, teacher. <laughs> okay, ha, tell us. Mm, no, I don't know anyone. <laughs> okay. Mm, uh, I think action sport is not recommended to 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 huh? for all age mm, because mm, it dangerous for the kids. Uh, uh, it's dangerous for the kids or maybe it's dangerous for old people. So imagine your teacher doing bungee jumping, all right, suddenly the rope, <laughs> <laughs> the slope, the rope was off, okay? Uh, imagine that will happen, right? Uh, it's very dangerous, okay? <laughs> uh, for kids and for old people especially, right? But you, teenagers, why don't? Okay, just try, okay? All right. Okay. Uh, that's all. Hab habis dah rasanya. All right, thank you. All right, so that's all for today. All right, thank you very much for your cooperation. Okay. All right, so boleh tak semua on camera set? Set teacher. Okay. Ha, pakailah towel, apa tuala ke? <laughs> okay, on camera set. Okay, teacher nak set gambar je. Okay, for documentation, that's all. Alright. Okay. Okay, Puan Dania, Izurin. Okay. Alright lah. So, yang lain tu mungkin bersegan kot apa. Okay, very good Dayang. Alright. One, two, three. Okay, very good. Thank you very much class. Okay, see you after holidays, right? Thank you, teacher. Okay, bye-bye. Right? Okay, thank you, teacher. Alright, thank you. Bye. Bye, teacher. Thank you. Thank you. Bye. Bye.